Hello and welcome back to the channel, it's the Sketch Monkey here and in today's video we're gonna have a look at the 67 Stingray. I did the front view a while back, I got a lot of DMs and messages about the rear view. People wanted to see the rear view as well and I've been wanting to do this for a long time and I finally took the time to do it and I'm looking at it right now and I can tell you this, I can't wait to show you the end result of this Stingray. It's one of the, mo the most fun I've had with a redesign on this channel to this date. With that said, let's jump in to the redesign. Let me show you the end result of this, both in front and rear view. So where to start? The 67 Stingray, it's such a beauty and this modernization was one of the most fun designs I've ever made on the channel and also one of the designs I'm most proud of. You know the feeling of being totally into what you do, time seems to stand still, an hour feels like five minutes and everything around you fades away, you're in the flow. That's exactly what happened here and it's one of the best feelings ever once you've entered that state of mind. If there is one redesign I would love to see come to life, this would be it. This 67 Stingray, I would love to see this in real life. I can't take credit for this though. Working with the 67 Stingray as a base means the job is already done. All I have to do is modernize a few details, emphasize a few key lines, lower the roof line just a little bit and stretch the A-pillar. Imagine designing this sculpture in the 1960s. I wish I could live through the introduction of this car. People must have been blown away when it was introduced by its original shape and beauty. Just take a look at all the details drawing inspiration from an actual Stingray. The hood scoop is the shape of an actual Stingray swimming towards the windshield. The front and rear bumpers reminds me of the wings of the Stingray and then we have the gorgeous subtle spine that runs along the center of the car fading out right before the distinct confident sharp rear line. I absolutely love this car and one day I will own one. The problem is you can't see the outside when you're driving it so I might just have it rotating on a turntable like the car we have here in front of us. Instead of watching the news in the morning, I'd go down to the garage, grab a chair and explore every line of the car as it rotates in front of me while I sip on my coffee. They don't do cars like this anymore. I know it sounds like a cliche, but it's true. The attention to detail, all the separate small trim pieces on the car, the different materials and finishes and the unique design language. During this time, the identity of the car brand was incorporated in the entire car. The body lines, the proportions, and it's not like today when if we remove the logo in the front, it becomes a generic car without a true identity. And that's why I love older cars. The personality and the feeling you get when you see them. Truly a piece of art. Because art, by definition, is supposed to invoke a feeling when you see them. And that's what old cars do to me. You know what? I'm not gonna talk anymore in this video. Instead, I'm going to let you watch this transformation and appreciate the design and lines of this Stingray. I'll come back by the end of the video. Enjoy.
Well, there it is guys, the redesign of the 1967 Chevy Corvette Stingray. Redesign or modernization, I think modernization is a better word for this type of design. And I've said it before, but I think I'm going to start making more of these, both rear and front view, because it gives a more complete look of the car and it gives, uh, it, ju it just satisfied the mind a little bit more to know if we have a rear view or a front view, we kinda, that we enjoy, we kinda naturally wanna see the other side of it. Keep commenting on your suggestions on cars to redesign. I hope you enjoyed this one as much as I enjoyed making it. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you're new. I'm the Sketch Monkey and I will see you in the next video. Take care.